And now, your Storm Team 18 forecast, weather from where you live. Well, I've looked at Storm Team 18 radar and satellite this morning. Most of us are dry right now, but we're focused on one area working into Warren County, just east of Attica, or west of Attica, west of Vetersburg at this hour. All this kind of moving off to the east, but we still have a lot of dry air in place which a lot of this will begin to kind of dissipate and fall apart as it works off to the east, but still can't rule out a few maybe light rain showers, a few sprinkles area wide this morning for a morning commute over the next two to three hours. But to looking at the surface map, here's a little surface front here, but the main cold front that's going to work in later this evening That'll have a drastic impact on our weather in the coming days. We'll have a sharp wind change this evening, which will in turn give us cooler weather over the next couple of days. But a very warm start compared to what we've seen last few mornings, about a 20 degree difference fit at 55 there. Delphi 56 currently Monticello 51 Remington 52 in Lafayette. So really not chilly out there. Definitely a big difference. But as we get toward that afternoon hour, we'll see highs of 78 with a southwest wind about 5 to 10 miles per hour. We'll get more sun out, especially after about 9, 10 o'clock. So keeping low chances for a sprinkle or two in the morning and then more sunshine this afternoon. And then we'll have kind of a second wave pass through and this will show here on future cast. So this morning, maybe an isolated sprinkle or two by 9, 10 o'clock. We'll start to get the sun really out here with mostly sunny skies. And then later on this evening, there's that main cold front. Notice the northwest wind, maybe a quick little shower with this to the northwest kind of falls apart as it works into our viewing area. So can't rule out just a stray shower this evening into very early Friday morning. But the main rainfall event tomorrow will be northwest of Lafayette, Newton and Jasper County coming off of Lake Michigan. Could be seeing an isolated rain shower too pretty much all day northwest of our viewing area for us here in Lafayette. May see a few clouds, maybe even a light rain shower to north of Lafayette by the evening. So really tomorrow, not a bad day. It's just going to be a very chilly one and blustery one as well, but we'll keep that 15% chance to the northwest with those rain showers with highs tomorrow only in the mid 50s. So your seven day forecast shaping up to be like a fall like weekend. It'll be a beautiful one. We'll have a lot of sunshine Saturday and Sunday highs Saturday 58 lows near freezing. So widespread frost bring those plants inside there for Saturday and Sunday. Then we warm back up into the mid to upper 70s by Tuesday and Wednesday. Yesterday wasn't too bad and then today looks yeah. like it's still going to be a little bit warm for us, but changes yeah. are in store. Big changes for sure. We'll have that cold front come in tonight, make way for a very chilly weekend ahead, but yeah. a lot of sunshine expected. So that's good news yeah. for the forecast. Absolutely, and we could definitely use some rain too for sure. Yeah, we're really underneath where we should be for rainfall for this time. So yeah. any rain is welcome, but it looks like we will not be seeing much up until maybe middle of next week is our okay. next best chance of rain. All right, good to know, David. Thank